Hey, what is up, guys? Johnny here, back with another Shadowgun Legends video. Today, Shadowgun Legends news, what's going on this week in Shadowgun Legends. We'll cover the events and the new recent additions, a cosmetic set, and a new legendary AR. So before we start, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel for more Shadowgun Legends videos. So let's start, guys. Let's start with the event that is about to end. About a day and a half left as I'm recording this. The sponsored event ROG has entered the game. So yeah, we did talk about it a bit last week. Uh, they released the ROG Phone 2. And they had a collab with Shadowgun Legends on both sides, by the way. Because they did show Shadowgun Legends on their um, media event. But Shadowgun Legends made an event in the game with the ROG. The event was pretty cool. It was short, only a week. We've been used to some two weeks events lately. The rewards were okay, I guess. That was a brand new pistol, and I know the stats look pretty dope. I didn't see great perks yet, but yeah, it's random. A uh, full set of armor also we haven't seen in a while, and it looks pretty cool, but again, the perks, you know? But there was a triple HP chest, which is pretty hard to find, and I know a lot of players did not have a good one. 39% HP is actually really good, and if you miss it, guys, well, that's what you get for not being on the jhc gaming discord link in the description by the way join the jhc discord and check out the perks alert the shop perks alert channel that's the first thing i check every morning when i wake up i open the discord and check the shop alerts just make sure i don't miss something crazy so yeah people were pretty quick to spot i don't know if you guys have seen this screenshot guys but a brand new cosmetic set full body with a hat the hat is a brand new model and the ROG Hurricane cosmetic set. Uh, also, the colors are freaking crazy, like purple-ish and pink-ish. And uh, yeah, that is exclusive, guys. The only players that can have that are the guys that bought the ROG phone. So if they got ROG phone too, I guess they can claim. I don't know if it's a redemption code or something, but they can claim their cosmetic set. And also a legendary AR. But what I have for information, guys, is they will introduce these items later in the game for everyone. But it is going to be in different colors. So this exact set is only for people who bought the ROG Phone 2. Now, the AR, uh, something pretty weird also. I, I mean, it looks good, but we've seen two different set of uh, stats. The first one was on the mad stream by uh, Marek. He was using that one on stream and it shows 149.6 damage and 350 fire rate. But another screenshot that we saw um, on the Discord showing 158, 355. So I don't know what's up with that. Are we gonna have two different models of the ROG Strix car? One for the ROG uh, owners and one for the players later in the game. I don't know. It's pretty weird to see two different set of stats And I don't know what's up with that. But anyways more details later. Maybe if people ask around maybe they will answer maybe it was just uh, Like pre-release and post-release stats, you know, sometimes they show something But then they they balance it before they release it So anyways talking about the upcoming events because new event is about to start in about a day uh, yeah, I don't know if you guys heard, but we have a new event manager. It's Riak or Ryak. He's gonna be responsible for the upcoming events. And we have a bit of details on the next one, which will be called Shadow Hunter event. And this one will be based around skills and their usage. So that doesn't say much, but apparently I'm guessing we're gonna have some challenge based on using skills. And it doesn't say skill kills it just says using skills so it could be anything and maybe it will force some players to respec to use specific skills just to meet the requirements for the challenges but we don't know that yet about i will have to wait about a day uh, also we know that the fame for some skill based ribbons and medals will be increased so this event will be good for people who like to farm fame. This time you'll have some specific skills to use if you want to increase your quick fame. Now about the rewards, Marek today on the mad stream, he said 
Uh, maybe we won't have some really big rewards in the next few events. But this time, apparently, we'll have an option to get some unique camo and a lot of it. So that's what they started doing now. They know that that's what we want. Whenever there is like token based event, like we don't want to be stuck with our tokens. We want to be able to spend them at the end. So they did it for a few events in a row. Uh, I think it's cool that they listen to the community. So if people play more, they get more. Uh, although it's just some camels, some guys are not so hype about it, but still it's better than not having anything to do with our tokens. Now about the upcoming events after the next one, what I know is we will have now a series of smaller events. I guess it's gonna be to fill the gap between now and maybe the Halloween event because usually they do something pretty big for Halloween and then Christmas or New Year. So uh, it's mid-September already, so I'm guessing maybe five small events before the big one or something like that. The next couple events will mainly be based around the fame. So uh, like this time they will increase the fame for some skill ribbons and skill medals. Maybe next couple events will be extra fame for doing some other stuff. But we don't have more details now except that. So next week, Shadow Hunter event about using skills, extra fame for medals and ribbons. And we're going to get some new camos and we'll be able to buy a lot of it. And then I guess a uh, few smaller events until Halloween. So that's pretty much it guys. That's all I have for today. Mostly positive stuff. I like that the ROG cosmetic set will be available later and especially the legendary AR. I mean, it would really suck that we don't have a chance to have it. Uh, even if it's going to be a different color. I mean, if it's going to be the same model and same name and same stats, of course, I don't have anything to say about it. So I cannot wait to see the next event, guys. Cannot wait to see if we'll have to respec tons of times just to get everything. I don't know what the challenges will be, but like I said, it's not... It doesn't say skill kills. It just says using skills. So maybe... I don't know, maybe invisibility stuff or hunter mines or whatever. We will see. So until then, guys, have a great week. Don't forget to subscribe for more Shadowgun Legends news, gameplay, and guides. And please, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like. And I will be back soon. Until then, watch my other videos. Take care. Extraction unit to SG. Coming in moment fast for a hostile extraction. Be ready, sir.